Welcome to Standing on the Promises. Today, we're going to be standing very firmly on Exodus chapter 6, verse 8. It says, I will bring you into the land that I swore to give Abraham, to Isaac, and to Jacob. I will give it to you for a possession. I am the Lord. As a child of Abraham, I need you to know that you are entitled to this promise. Secondly, you must note that the Lord has capacity. Not only does he make promises, he also has the ability to make them happen. Never forget. There is a place he has prepared for you. Yes, you. And he intends that you get there. So he will bring you, carry you, bear you up, convey you, in fact, transport you anyhow necessary till you get to the land. Note, you are not alone in life. God is your partner on this destiny journey. Let us pray. Father, thank you for selecting choice land for your people. In business, ministry, academics, family, and all other ventures, you have picked out the very best for us. We are grateful. Today we ask that you set in motion everything that will take us there. Everything that will lead us to that promised land. Father, we ask that you set them in motion. Our inheritance shall not be cut off. Today, O oh God, I pray for the weak and the discouraged, for the disheartened and the, the, the doubtful, for the distressed amongst us. Lord, help them, strengthen them, empower them in the name of Jesus. Release divine energy and grace to your people so they'll be able to move on and take hold of your blessings. Today, I rebuke the spirits of hell resisting us. I rebuke those manipulating spirits that inject fear and doubt and sin into the hearts of God's people. I arrest them and I hold all their activities. I say they end now, 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 in the name of Jesus. We declare that we are marching forward. We are going on and we are going in. In Jesus' name, amen. Before you go, declare with me. The lines have fallen for me in pleasant places. I have a beautiful inheritance. I am daily on my way towards my possession. And I will never be cut off from it. Thank you, Father, for hearing and answering. In Jesus' name mighty name. Amen.